Hi guys, thank you for joining me back on my channel. I have an AliExpress pen haul for you today. Now I haven't bought these recently, I actually bought most of these sort of mid-December, in fact I bought all of them mid-December, I bought them around the same time. Some of the pens when they arrived I've already filmed, so that will come first, and then the ones that have come more recently I'm going to tag on sort of towards the end of the video, so I will be back in a moment. Now, my love affair of kawaii pens started with this. This I received in a Happy Mail from Lisa, who is Potsy Fighter here on YouTube. And I use this pen up very, very quickly because it writes beautifully. And I journal each night before I go to sleep. And so these pens, they don't last very long. I will give you that. But I really, really enjoyed writing with this. So I decided to replace it and buy some more. And I bought a lot. Because, as I say, they don't last very long and I got very distracted by all of the beautiful types of pens. So I picked up a set of donut pens. So this is the one that I had previously and it comes in this little set of four. So you've got this peached pe peach pen with this donut on the end. Then you have yellow with a sprinkle donut on the end. Then pink with the spotty donut. And then blue with the stripy donut. And all of these pens write in black ink. And as you can see, they write beautifully, write really smoothly. That's just on my hand and it's coming out perfect. So those are the donut pens that I picked up. As I say, £1.37 for those. Then I picked up some fruit pens. So same sort of thing, but these have got fruit on the end. So you've got a white pen with a little pineapple on the end and you've got the green with the apple then blue with what I assume to be a pear and then peach with a little strawberry and that set of four fruit cost me £1.24 £1.24 for those I've also bought a ton of pens that have detachable charms on the end. So I'll show you what I mean by showing you these beautiful, beautiful pom-pom pens. So it's the same kind of pen, just a simple gel pen with a really thin nib. Focus for you. It's just got a really thin nib that just writes in black ink. But each of these pens has got like a little dangly charm on the end. Oh, did I just do that? Oh, whoops. Whoopsie. Give that a wipe. Now, as you can see, this has got a lilac pom-pom and it comes on a little lobster clasp. So my thinking was when these pens run out, these charms would be great for pocket letters and friend mail. So that was, that was the main reason I got them actually, because I had looked for these charms individually. I wanted to buy these pom-pom charms. I thought, well, if you can buy them attached to pens, you must just be able to buy them, and you can't. So I picked up the set of six. This cost me £3.82. So you've got the purple. You've got grey. You've got a black pen with a white pom-pom. Then you've got this peach colour. Hmm, pink. And then light blue. So as I say, £3.82 for the set of six. And I can reuse the pom-poms. Then I have these pens. Now I picked up a set of five pens with the glass globe charms. But these were described as random. So you just got a random selection. These cost me £2.77. They're a little bit more expensive than buying them all separately. But I was intrigued to see what came. So I've got this mint green pen. It looks quite blue on camera, but it's quite mint in real life. With a rose gold charm with clear diamonds in it. So I've got that one. And then I've got two pink pens. One says princess with a little crown. The other one is completely plain. The one that is plain also has a crystal charm. So pink crystals. Again, on like a rose gold chain. I do like the rose gold. And the pen that says Princess has got little pink stars as the charm. And this is gold this time instead of rose gold. 
then I've got this it's it's grey it looks a little bit blue on camera but it's a really pale grey pen and then I have a rose gold charm with clear crystals in this one on that pen and then I have this really beautiful purple pen like a watercolour effect on the pen the purple lid and then this one's got a blue crystal globe at the top again on oh sorry I'm completely out of frame again this is sort of a rose gold colour it's quite faint it looks a bit gold on camera and that's that one and then they've obviously sent this as a little free gift so it's a green pen it says Paul and Paulina sorry it's not focusing there you go she's so got a little purple clip thing so this is a biro by the looks of it it's got the little um, nib thing on it to protect the end and then if I can just quickly scribble on a piece of paper oh it's green so this is a green pen this one so that's another five of the glass globe pens with my free little green pen which I can actually use for marking at school because that's the colour I'm marking so that's quite useful and then the next lot of pens I bought all from the same seller so they're all still in the same bag now there are a few breakages which I'm going to email the seller about but I'll show you what I ordered anyway so if I pull out the smaller bags and just set them aside okay I'm going to start with this bag here now this each bag of these cost me £2.51 for all of the bags I'm about to show you all for sets of five all from the same seller so you can see a, a theme there now this is a set of five with this sort of watercolour in effect on the pens so you've got the dark purple, the dark pink, the grey, the mint and the light pink and then each one oh, has a glass globe, oh, I've tangled them up has a glass globe charm on the end with different coloured crystals and each one has a slightly different colour crystal to match its pen and each of the charms on this one are rose gold so that's quite different to I've already bought glass globe charms as you know but I've, the tops of them are gold so these ones are rose gold which is quite nice um, as I say I like this seller because in my assortment of five I got five different colours I got one of each I didn't just get whatever they fancied sending so that's the diamonds so they're all labelled as detachable pens and then I'll tell you the names as we go so that was the diamonds then I picked up these these ones are the stars so same price set of five then these ones I've all got that little princess that you've seen before so you've got the pink the bluish grey the lilac the mint and the darker purple so that's the pens and then in the glass globes of these you've got star confetti so again it matches the colour of the pen and it's absolutely beautiful and when I bought the glass globe charms previously like I didn't have any of this colour I haven't got any of this colour for example so they're very different and I'm sure I've mentioned when I showed you other pens my intention is when the pens have run out to use these as charms on planners and pocket letters and things put them in friend mail then this next set is called Luminous so same thing, set of 5, £2.51 and they're glass globes now the pens on these have got a quote, or oh, I'm all tangled up if I hold this up it says never too late to start fighting and I absolutely love that and you've got this kind of watercolour effect going down the pen let me come a bit closer and see if it will show you so there's, there's the sort of peachy yellow one Then you've got purple blue green and pink also the same thing all have those like strips of watercolour going down the pen and then again they've each got a glass globe charm to match the colour which I'm just going to untangle a moment oh goodness what's happened what is happening okay but these are very different to any of the other ones I've bought previously because it's like flocking not sure how well it will show you. They're like sort of flocking crystals. It's really cool. Let's see if you can kind of see that. So there's the pink. And then you've got the green. The blue. Excuse my dog barking downstairs. The purple. Oh. Struggling to focus, isn't it? The purple. And then 
that is a very luminous yellow. As I say, it's like flocking powder. It's quite cool. They're really different to all the others, so I absolutely love those. Then this next set, I actually bought two sets of, but in one of them, one of the pens is broken. So these were called the Fruits. Oh, turns out this one's broken as well. That's a shame. Right, anyway, let's go through. So you've got this blue pen with the kiwi, kiwi that says, Hola, kiwi. It's got this really cute little kawaii person holding up the kiwi. Really, really cute. And then in the glass globe at the end, you've got these little female pieces of kiwi. Kiwi fruit, which is really, really cute. I wish I could get this to focus better for you, sorry. There you go. So that's the kiwi pen. Then you have this one that says, ciao. And then obviously that is supposed to say orange. And then you've got the little person crying because of the orange. And then in the glass globe of this one, you've got the little orange segments. Then you've got the apple that I obviously can't read. And you've got the little one with the poke tongue face. And then you guessed it, little pieces of apple in here. And I just, I absolutely loved the fruit. I thought they were great. And you've got this one that's got the watermelon. Again, I can't read that one. You've got the little happy face there. And then you've got the slices of watermelon in your glass globe. And then this final one, I just um, the little findings popped off, so I can attach that back on. You've got the strawberry. You've got the little person with the strawberry on the pen. And it's like a lilac colour. And then this charm's just popped off, but you guessed it. It's got little strawberries in it. As I say, that's just the jump ring that's come off here. So I, c I can reattach that, that's not a problem. So that's the fruit. But... In the second set of the fruit, the kiwi one, it's been attached wrong, so part of the hole is poking out here. I don't know that the camera will pick that up, but as you can see, all the kiwi's fallen out. So I would prefer if they could replace that one, because all my kiwi pieces are just down here floating about in the bottom of the bag. And I did try taking that off. Um, to see if I could redo it, but I'm just going to end up breaking that, so I don't really want to do that. And then this final set, unfortunately, these were the ones I was most looking forward to, and one of them is broken, so I'm going to have to be really careful showing these to you, because it's full of sand. So these were the starfish pens, so if I can try and get the sand down the bottom. Now what these are, is each pen has got a shell... It's a white pen with a shell on the barrel with a black lid and then the glass globe charms on this have got a couple of little beach shells and some sand. So as you can see this one's got dark blue sand in it and you've got the two little shells and it's gold the findings on these. And I just thought they were really cool, they were so different. Like This one and the luminous I think are my favourite from this setter. So you've got the little shells. But one of these, the glass globe, has completely snapped off. So there it is. So I've just got the sand all floating about in the bottom of this bag. So then you've got this one with the purple sand. Again, you've got the little shells hidden in the sand there. And that's the shell that's on the barrel. Then you've got... Oh, This one here with the conch shell, and that one's got light blue. Oh, again, you've got the little shells hanging around in there. You've got this one with the starfish, that's got pink sand in there, and then the final one was yellow sand, and it had a couple of conch shells in there. But obviously, I can't get the one out because you can see all the sand is at the bottom of the bag. So I will email the seller and just let them know that some of these are broken and hopefully they'll replace them because it has happened in transit but yeah that's um what i bought from that seller and i will link all of the sellers below 
I also ordered this set of six macaroon pens or macaron pens. I would say macaroon, some people say macaron. Either way, they are two they were two pound fifteen and as you can see on each of the pens it's got different sort of um biscuits and things on. So that's got like a little gatto, that one's got a little donut, that one's got macaroons, that one's got a little cupcake, and that one's got like a little um cake like a flan type thing and the last one's got a macaroon on its side is that focusing i hope it is sorry and then these ones the ends are clear they're a bit different to the other pens and then they've got that sort of like bit at the end not really sure the purpose of that whether it's just aesthetic because it unscrews but the actual pen itself is this end so that's a bit unusual that little clear bit but on the each on the end of each of the pens are these little macaroon charms and they're just plastic so you've got a purple one. Oh my goodness I'm not in frame at all am I you can see you've got mint green more of like a sage green orange blue pink and purple they're really lovely colors so those are the macaroon pens and if I didn't say already they were £2.15 for the set of six and one other thing that I've just noticed about the macaroon pens is you've got the charm on this end but on the lid end you've got a little gem so they don't match necessarily the color that's on here but you do have a little gemstone on the end as well which is quite fun so as I say they don't match but it's just a nice little added touch little gem on the lid now these next pens are not what I ordered I ordered two sets of these pens with little detachable donuts on and when I opened this, I thought, now I know I'm terrible and I have bought a lot, and I mean a lot of pens. However, I don't remember buying these. My dad was convinced I'd bought something I couldn't remember. So I'll show you what they are. They are pen, they are keys. So these pens, I've got 12 of them, and they're all keys. Now they're fun, but I definitely didn't order them. So I emailed the seller and I explained and they've promised that they'll send out the pens that I did order. So as you can see, you've got one pink one in each set that looks like this. And you've got a gold one in each set with just a loop. You've got a silver one in each set with just the loop. Then you've got a blue one in each set like the pink one. And then you have a silver and gold in each set with like a flat plaque at the top so that's what these look like now I paid £1.68 per set for the donut pens these ones are cheaper I can't remember what they were when I looked but I think they were about £1.30 a set so I mean they do have these on Aliexpress if you're interested in these they're not what I bought so I'm going to give them away in friend mails and things like that maybe take them into school and use them up because as I say they don't last too long um, but I'm really pleased but one thing that I should mention is that every single one of these pens in the whole haul you can buy refills for the inside so whereas I've bought lots of different pens because I then want to use the charms afterwards you could if you wanted to buy the refills quite cheaply and keep the same pens and just keep refilling them so that's just a top tip for everybody. So when I get the new pens, I'll include them in this video. And these are the pens that should have come instead of those key ones that I've shown. So each pen has got sprinkles on them. So you can see you've got the pink, the sort of whitish grey, yellow, brown, green and blue. And then each pen has a little donut charm. But if I show you the pink one, it's got this really cute little cat with glasses grey one has got a panda like that the yellow one has got a little duck they're just too cute as well these little charms they're quite sturdy as well oh, and then the green ones like a little monster it looks like Mike Wazowski from Monsters Inc to me <laughs> then the brown one is a little bear that's the little bear and then the blue one is to me it looks like sort of a cat but I'm not really too sure it doesn't have ears so tell me what you think that one could be I thought it was a cat because of the little whiskers is it gonna focus 
Whoa. A little bit. There you go. So those are the pens that should have come instead of the key ones. And as I said, I ordered two sets of these because I absolutely want to keep a set of these charms for myself. And then I thought I could give the other set out as friend mail. These next pens I was a bit disappointed with actually because it's a set of four detachable rose pens. They cost me £1.33. But in the picture there was gold, blue, red and green. But as you can see I've been sent two red. So I am going to email the seller and say that that's a bit naughty really. If you've advertised it as a set of four with four different colours, why have I received two of the red one? Let's see what they say. Because actually the green one was my favourite. That was the main reason I picked these up. And as you can see, you've got these little plastic rose charms on the end. And these pens are metallic. And I bought them again for friend mail. Or if I use the pens, then these charms can be reused for friend mail and things like that. Sorry, it's really dark today, isn't it? I've moved my light in. I don't think I like this place. So those are the little charms on the ends of these. Then I ordered these. Now these were labelled as star charm pens and they were £2.06. And I'm a little bit disappointed because like the rose ones, rather than rather than sending me one of each colour, I have got duplicates again. I've got two of the yellow and then I've got one of this black and then one of the blue. Which is a bit of a shame, but I wish they wouldn't do that, because this pen's also the same. They might have slightly different coloured balls, but the pens are the same. You would think if you're ordering an assortment, you would get an assortment, but maybe that's just me being picky, I don't know. So as I say, these ones have got, it says, You of the Sky. I'm not really sure what that means, but You of the Sky is. You've got this sort of watercolour pattern on the pens. It's the same pattern on each of these pens, but these ones have obviously got the yellow colour these ones have got the blue and then the charms themselves are like crackle glass so that's the yellow one now these have just got rubber bands to keep them flat against the pen at the moment so I haven't taken those off and as you can see it's a gold chain and these ones have got a clear lid and then the pen is, is this end a bit different to the macaroons so there's the yellow one, there's two of that one then you've got this like black oil type effect and then you've got this sort of purpley blue. And they are really lovely. As I say, I just maybe it's just me being really picky, but I would prefer four different colours if I'm going to order a set of assorted. Then I got these ones. They were labelled as, oh, were they labelled as glass globes? Kawaii coloured globes they were labelled as. So it was a set of five and they were £4.07. It was the only seller I could find that did these. So the pens are just completely plain, so you've got the mint, pink, purple, blue and peach. And then at the end of each one you get a gold chain and then it's a glass globe, just plain coloured but a bit iridescent, with a jewellery finding at the top, like a little crown, and they're on gold clips. So obviously the colour matches the colour of the pen. So there's the mint green one. And then the peach pen has got quite an orangey coloured globe. Then there's the blue, and there's the pink, and then there's the purple. And this set came with a free pen, which is this kind of greyish brown. This one came free. And this one's got a different charm, so it's got this triangle with a little flower on it. And then at the bottom it's got a little bead with another one of those jewellery findings. That's quite nice of them to include a little free gift. So that one was my freebie. This next set of pens, I made a bit of a mistake with these to be quite honest with you. Now they're beautiful, there's 12 pens and they cost me 4 95 and they are these, they are diamond feather pens. So they are absolutely stunning. If I just lay them out as you can see they've come in 12 different colours now when I read the description and it told me assorted colours I thought they just meant the pen was assorted colours but they're not, each pen writes in that corresponding colour so that writes in blue, that writes in red, that writes in purple etc etc so I intended to buy these to give these out in friend mouse because I thought if they were black pens 
then it would just be the colour of the feather that you'd be getting. You wouldn't need to sort of worry about the colour that it wrote in. But I was wrong. So they are stunning. I'm not, I'm, I could still give them out in front mail. There's nothing stopping me giving someone a red pen. There'd be nothing stopping me doing that. But I'm going to use up sort of more of the black inks and things first, I think. And I've, I've tried bullet journaling in the past didn't really work for me because I am a bit too prescriptive and I ha I couldn't go just go with the flow I needed to make it too perfect but I do want to start sort of in the middle of bullet journal plan planning um just to keep on top of things to keep on top of like my happy mail that I'm sending out things like that so I'm going to keep these for me for the time being um and yeah see how I feel about handing those out but they are stunning and as I say 4.95 for the set of 12 I picked up two sets of biscuit pens. So these have got detachable biscuit charms. So one set cost me £1.43, the other set cost me £1.45. But again, I've got duplicates in the sets. So in this set, the pens have got flowers on the on the barrels. You can see I've got two with the white and pink, one with the white and purple, and then one of the green. So that's the barrels of the pens. And then on the top on the green one, there's this little blue biscuit and a clear heart charm. Got white on the other side, something more like a chocolate sweet. On the purple one, you've got this little purple biscuit with the white on the back. Again, the little clear heart. Then on the pink ones, you've got these. So pink on one side, white on the other. Little clear hearts as well. And then in the other set... Pens are different, they're not floral. These ones have got cats. And then these ones have got that one looks oh that one looked like a bunny to me, but maybe they're all cats. I think they might all be cats. They say sweet love on them with little macarons and donuts and things on the barrels. And then these ones, so the green's still got the same charm with the blue and white little sweetie. The pink one, whereas that one was white and pink, this one's all pink, but it has the same charm. And then these two pens have got the same lid, although they're different pens. And they both have these little sort of chocolate charms, but these have got a gold chain instead of a silver chain. So it's slightly different. Apologies if you could hear my dogs then. So those ones are the little biscuit pens. So that's it. That is my AliExpress haul because I have I have previously filmed quite a lot of these. So I've got all sorts of fun ones like the pom-poms, the glass globes. Then I've got this little pot here with all the sort of jelly ones. I'm missing one of the donut pens. I think I've given one away in friend mail. I can't really remember. Um, so I've got them all kind of hanging about on my bed at the moment. I've got to sort them out. Now, I know I'm in the 100 Things Challenge. I haven't bought these recently. I'm sure I've mentioned already that I did buy these back in December. So I haven't broken the challenge, but this is one of the reasons that I'm doing the challenge because clearly, even teaching, I don't need this many pens. So I'm looking forward to handing some of these out in friend mail. But as I did say before, they don't last very long because the, the bit in the middle, oh, these ones are thicker, actually but this doesn't normally have very much ink in it so I, gen I journal every evening so I do go through pens quite quickly hence why I bought I can buy the refills and carry on using the same pens but I just love the fact that I can keep changing my pen because some of these are just too cute I mean look at this little cat with the glasses I want you to look but it's not focusing there you go how can you not think that's cute so sweet so thank you for joining me. I'm sorry it's been quite a long video and it might be a bit choppy where I'm going to have to now edit this all back together. And I'm really sorry that there's very, very little on my channel at the moment because I'm waiting for people's addresses so that I can send off their friend mail and then I'll be able to upload an absolute ton of videos that I'm really, really excited about. So I will see you all in my next video. Take care, everyone. Bye-bye.